Hi, this is Emma, and welcome to Esoteric Detective. There is many anomalies with the astronaut photos claimed to be taken on the moon, through the Apollo space missions. I have done another video on these, but out of all of them, I believe I have missed the smoking gun. That is, the proof that NASA faked photographs of the moon. I'm going to show you two photographs. Both are official NASA photographs that have been seen around the world, many times, appearing in official NASA films and books. Let's take a look at what we will call the first photograph. This photo was taken by Apollo 15 at what is called the ILSEP site or Station 5. Looks good enough. We can see the lander in the photograph. An astronaut was behind the lens and took this photograph. All seems well. But there is something very strange if we look closer. And we only see it, when we look at another Apollo 15 photograph. Let's take a look at what we will call, the second photograph. This photograph was taken at Station 9, called Hadley Rill location. That is 1.4 kilometers west from the lunar module. Or 1.4 kilometers west of the location of the first photograph. Have a close look. See if you can spot what is in both photographs. Do you see it? Maybe it will help if I put both photographs beside each other. Now take a look. Do you see it now? That's right. The backgrounds are identical. In fact, if we superimpose one over top of the other, they match completely. Not only that, but the lunar module is gone from one photograph. So even if they logged the same photo by mistake as different locations, then there would be no one to take the photo. Because there is no lunar module. This excludes, any logging or simple photo tagging errors by NASA. Since, the lunar module cannot be moved. It lands, and then takes off from the same location. The evidence shows, without a shadow of a doubt, that the same backdrop was used. That is, a backdrop on a film stage. Again, let's look at both examples side by side. Do you see it now? They have just shifted around the foreground, one photograph with rocks in it, another with dust. But they used the same background. Now look at perspectives on Earth. We might not be engineers, but we all know about perspective, that is we have looked at hills and mountains, and landscapes all our lives. So we have knowledge in this area, all of us do. So how can you have the exact same landscape in the far background, appear in a different location, that is 1.4 kilometers away? The fact is, you cannot. This cannot happen in nature. Now let's have a look at one other example. This was taken on Apollo 17. Links to all pictures will be in the description. These images have now been cropped by NASA on their website, only offering the view of the hills themselves. There are non-cropped images however that still exist. These examples were taken from the Richard D. Hall documentary, Apollo Conspiracy. This, I believe, is the smoking gun. Take a look at what we will call image 3. Look at the background. Now look at image 4. And have a look at the background. One has the lunar module in it, the other does not. So if they are the same location, then who is taking the photo? Since if there is no lunar module, then there is no way the astronauts could be in this location. What do you guys think? Is this the smoking gun? Or can you explain this photograph with other natural means? Stay tuned and subscribe to Esoteric Detective, to keep up to date with the strange and unusual. And please give a thumbs up, if you liked the video. And do let me know what you think in the comments section. Until next time. The eagle has landed. Jesus saved Christ. Houston. Houston, we're on the fucking boat. Roger, Tranquility, we copy that. We cannot believe you are on the fucking moon. Repeat, cannot fucking believe it, over.